going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. If this is your first time joining me today, my name is Noah Cavanaugh and I'm a professional soccer player currently playing down in Perth, Australia. Today I'm going to show you five different shooting drills that I think are absolutely essential for any attacking player and as a wingback I tend to use these quite often in training or I'll come to the practice field beforehand to do some of these drills just so that it helps me uh, get in the rhythm of taking shots and being confident taking shots when I'm going forward as a wingback. So without further ado guys, let's hop into the video. All right, fam, so the first drill that we're gonna hop into that I'll show you really quick is we're gonna start building on some stuff. So the first drill we're gonna do is just a simple juggle in a box square of cones, and then as soon as I hit maybe five or seven, I'm gonna pop it up above my head, take a touch down and explode forward, get through four cones, and then play it more as like a warm-up passing. So it's gonna be much more focused on accuracy for the first drill, and then I will hit one of the corners. I've gotta hit 10 on each side. I've got 10 balls, so hopefully I can hit 10 for 10, but if not, then I'll just rotate the balls back around and get as many as I need to before I hit 10 on the right, 10 on the left side. So I'll show you that drill really, really quick. Here's what that looks like. So over here, you've got the box right there, and then the cones, and then set it up so that the cones are there on either side of the the line. Here we go. Alright guys, that is the first drill. So managed to hit like 10 out of 15 or 16 on my right foot and then 10 out of 10 on my left foot. So obviously left foot dominant, but no excuses, wanna get much better at that right foot one as well. So just to make sure I'm getting lots of good touches in. So next one, we're gonna keep with that box. This time we're gonna incorporate a little bit of dribbling. All I'm gonna do is dribble from one of the bottom cones closest to the net around the top cone and then out that same side and have a crack and then I'll have a ball sitting at the other side as well around the corner make a move outside and then we'll go through like that so now we're gonna go probably since it's two balls per and I've got 10 balls we'll go two rounds through so we got 20 balls total 10 shots each side I'm gonna see how many I can hit into those corners with the pink cones in the goal here we go
All right, fam, so that is drill number two. Um, drill number three is going to be sort of drill number three, but drill number three, four, and five. So there's three different variations of it. What I'm gonna do is I'm going to go through a set of cones and then I've got one defender, two defenders, starting on the left side as if I was a left back. So I'll show you that in just a sec. Here we go. Um, you've got your cones right there, defender one, defender two in orange right there, two cones. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to go through the cones over on this side, go left footed shot, right footed shot, and then cut in on my right and then inside that second defender. So basically what we are working on right now is essentially trying to get that 1v1 skills up at the top, top, top level for when I'm playing wing back or left back or even winger at some time. So that's the idea for this drill. So this will be our last drill, but it's three different variations of this last one. So hopefully you guys can get tons and tons of reps. I'm already sweating. I've been out here for like an hour and 15 minutes already just with the reps and the warm up and everything. Again, shooting drills are supposed to be about quality, not necessarily quantity. Obviously, if you can get more, do more. Um, but it's really, really important to make sure that the quantity uh, excuse me, the quality is uh, correct on these ones. So let's hop into this last one and we'll, I'll show you all three variations. Super simple, hopefully hit some top bins on this one. Here we go. All right, not so great on that first round. Um, was trying to hit that far post every time and just ball was curling away from me, but you know what, that's what it is. Just gotta learn from, the, learn from that technique and keep on going. So now we're gonna cut inside and do the first cone right footed. All right, here we go.
that was second iteration. Did okay on that one, much better. Um, just trying to get corners down. And again, right footed, just trying to get those repetitions in. So we'll hop into the third one, which is gonna be right side cut at the yellow cones and then inside cut on the orange and then I can hit it with right or left foot. Here we go. guys that is it for the video thanks so much for joining me today for this shooting drill session it is a really great session for getting lots of reps in especially when I'm on my own and I don't have a goalkeeper with me super easy to do just a couple different cones and I probably could have done this drill with about six or seven cones total so if you don't have a ton no stress at all feel free to translate the left-sided stuff over to the right side if you are more of a right-sided player right back right winger etc or attacking mid for that matter and that is going to be it for this video drop a comment below what other videos you'd like to see what other training sessions you'd like to see i can't promise i can make absolutely everything simply because i'm starting season really soon and i need to be really cautious with the way that i'm training but if you have any other topics that you'd like me to cover put those down in the comments make sure you subscribe like the video if you got value from it and as always guys be awesome take care and i'll see you guys in the next one